Today I'm going to show you how to connect your HDMI and VGA cord to use your Chromebook and ThinkClient as a two screen system. Okay, so first you're going to take the end of your HDMI cord and you're going to plug it into your Chromebook. Then you're going to take the VGA end and you're going to lift your thin client and tilt it. And you're going to plug it into the VGA port closest to the power cord. Okay, and as you can see, nothing changed on our screens. They still look the same. But if you go and press the source button, you now have a two screen system. You can see this screen is larger, you don't have to squint as much. Now these are not going to work with this system. Only this keyboard is gonna work with this system. These will continue to work with your thin client if you press the source button. Thin client will show up if you press the source button. But right now, we are using our Chromebook. Uh, as a two screen system, so these accessories will not work. Okay, if you would rather have a mirrored image, this is actually, oh, see I made a mistake, I need to use this mouse. The, this is actually a two screen extended system, that means we're using two different screens, they're not gonna show the same thing. So on this side, we might have a browser, and on this side we might have a spreadsheet, or vice versa. If you would rather have them show the same image, you can go to the search function on your Chromebook and put in settings, scroll down, to device and displays. Okay, now there are a couple things you need to notice here. There are two rectangles on here. One says internal display and one says sync master. The internal display is referring to the Chromebook. The Sync Master is referring to the Thin Client. If your Chromebook is sitting on the left of your desk, then the internal display rectangle needs to be sitting on the left of this window. If your Thin Client is sitting on the right of your desk, then the Sync Master needs to be on the right of the window. If you have them opposite, let's say your Chromebook was over here, then you would move these by clicking the rectangle and dragging it over. That doesn't seem important until you try to use your mouse and your mouse won't work right, your windows will be out of order so you have to take your mouse the opposite direction. So make sure, since my Chromebook is on the left, make sure that your internal display matches where your Chromebook is located on your desk. Internal display Chromebook, Sync Master for ThinkClient. And they are in order, left and right. Okay, there's a box here that says mirror internal display. If I want these two screens to show exactly the same thing all the time, I'll check that box. See how they are mirrored now? If I want them to be extended so that I have a two screen system and I can work on something here and something different here, then I'll do the extended. And I do believe it defaults to extended. If I wanna to toggle back to my thin client, I press the source button. Okay, 